Protect your automotive investment with advanced repair and maintenance at Lamont's Express Lube and Automotive Repair. We invest in our facility and our technicians so we can provide you and your vehicle with the highest level of service. We're proud of our reputation for honest service. Please contact us today for information or service. Mention this ad for 10% off labor. Good morning. I'm Chuck Chesney. I'm running for city council. I have a, about 30 years of high level management experience in the airline business. I also hold a master's degree from the University of California in Berkeley. I have a lot of experience that I think will relate directly to the problems that we have in Preston. My hot button issue is jobs. We need to have high paying, steady jobs for the kid, mostly for the kids growing up because this town, like, like all cities, has, faces financial struggles. We have got to be able to support the infrastructure that, that needs to be repaired. We need to make sure that we can uh, continue to have a city that is welcoming to people at the same time, uh, one that can compete with the surrounding, uh, surrounding cities and countryside. I have the experience, I have the education, I have the time, and I certainly have the passion. Thank you very much. Hello, I'm Randy Harris. I'm running for Preston City Council. I presently hold a council position that I was appointed to back in February to fill a vacancy. Uh, I would like to continue on with my work and see Preston develop and grow in a way that will uh, be beneficial to the community and to the businesses coming in. I want to see some more jobs in town, but I want to see jobs that local people can be hired to and that it'll help our citizens uh, get a, a better pay, paycheck and a better foundation for their lives. Uh, I'm family oriented. I've, I've been married for 45 years to my wife, Lucinda Smith. I have five children and 14 grandchildren and they're the most important things in my life. Um, I'd like to be your city councilman for another four years and hope that I can uh, guide this city in the ways it needs to go. And there's some real tough decisions coming up for the citizens in the city council and I hope you'll come and support us at our meetings. Thank you. On November 3rd, the residents of Preston City will have many choices when they go to the polls. My name is Terry Larson, and I'm running for one of the two open city council seats here in Preston City. I'm a lifelong resident of Preston. My wife, Christine, and I have six children, a son-in-law, and one granddaughter. I've worked for the past 25 years at Newcore Steel in Plymouth, Utah, so I know what it's like to have to commute out of the area for gainful employment, so I realize the importance for good business here in Preston. That being said, we must first address the infrastructure issues here in Preston. With a near century old infrastructure, which is our water, sewer, and road system, and a near capacity sewer treatment facility, those issues must be addressed first before we can move forward with growth in the city. I plan to work very diligently at moving forward with those, as well as working with the Planning and Zoning Commission to see that all residents and businesses in the city are treated equally and fairly and there's no favoritism shown to anyone. The Greater Downtown District is of great importance to me and I would like to see that there are no more open storefronts here in Preston. I would like to work diligently with the service groups in the area to come up with ideas of how to bring about more business in the downtown area. I'm no stranger to service. I'm a member of the Franklin County Fire District. I've worked with the Ambulance Association. I am on a member of the Preston Outs Lodge. I'm on the school board for the Southeast Idaho Technical Academy and on an advisory board for the Bridgeland Area Technical College. On November 3rd, 
I would encourage everyone to get out and vote, and I would sincerely appreciate a vote for Terry Larson. Hi, my name is Bill Salerno, and I'm running for Preston City Council. The reason why I'm running for Preston City Council is because I love this community that we live in. I feel like I could be an ass a big asset to this community. As far as my experience I have here, I've served on several committees here. I've served on the Franklin County Theater Boards, Franklin County Theater Arts Council. Currently, on the, as a board member, I have been vice president and president of the theater. Also, um, the, the, a lot of things I've been able to accomplish is the, to get improvements there. And we, we go through a lot of volunteers and we've been able to obtain grants. And those are, those are private grants and donations. Nothing to do with federal grants. Also, another thing I want to accomplish as a member of the city council is to improve our sidewalks. As you've noticed that my wife and I, we take the streets a lot out there. We, the sidewalks are not very, very, very accessible to drive on with our wheelchairs. And so we have to take the things, we have to take the streets. Now, the sidewalks are cracked a lot. And so that's why I can see that how we can improve those is by obtaining grants for those. I used to work at Utah State University as an American with Disabilities Act ADA coordinator. And I know there's grants out there that are private grants that we can obtain to pay for those sidewalks and curb cuts. And that's one thing I, I would like to see get done here. Also, another important thing to me is beautifying our downtown, making it a lot better. I know we can do a lot more to it. One thing I idea I have is uh, to, the empty space over there where OP Skaggs used to be. I, I would like to see some picnic tables over there. And I'd like to see those you know, people can come there and then they can sit down and just enjoy being downtown. And then with that, I would establish a committee to, uh, to come up with ideas how we can beautify our downtown. And that is my wish here as a member of the City Council. I would appreciate your vote on November 3rd. Thank you. Hi, my name is Allison Wadsworth and I'm running for City Council. I decided to run for City Council because I have a huge desire to serve and to be involved in this, the success of Preston City. I, over the years, uh, with raising my family, have seen some concerns. I feel some of the biggest concerns right now are the infrastructure or the sewer and the water that we need to maintain so that we can uh, support the growth that is coming to Preston. I also feel like it's huge as a community that we need to be involved in bringing new businesses into our town so that our kids and our uh, people will have successful jobs and can support themselves here in our town. I also feel that I am running against six wonderful men, but I feel it's important um, that a woman's perspective be heard. I can help bring a woman's perspective with problem solving and budget and a woman's perspective is sometimes different. Not that my opinion always differs from the, from the men that I'm working with. I also would like to um, stress that everybody get out and vote next Tuesday. It's important and I think with seven people running that we can uh, have a great turnout because people are interested in the success of the city. I appreciate your vote. Thank you. Hi Preston citizens, my name is Bradley Wall and I am one of your candidates for City Council this year. Just to let you know a little bit about myself, my family and I moved here 10 years ago. We purchased a business that we've owned and operated since that time. Uh, we've, we came in and we immediately got involved in the community. We, I joined the Chamber of Commerce and have been a member of the Business Association since its founding and served as an officer and director. I've also served as president of the Lions Club and continue to be a member of that club where we do hundreds of hours of community service. So I'm not afraid to serve. It's something that's in my blood. It's what I love to do and I'm, I'm anxious to do that as a city council member. We have some serious issues that I think we are facing here in Preston City and uh, it's been talked about a lot. I know that there's been discussions. We had this community review process that has recently been completed. Um, I was one of the uh, people that joined in on the listening sessions and participated in that and along with several other residents of the town where we voice the things that we love about it, the things that uh, need to change and then we've had the uh, summary of that just this past week. There's great suggestions that are made in, this, in the community review report. 
but they are just suggestions. In order for us to take it to the next level, we've got to form our committees, and we've got to, we have a lot of action that has to take place in order to make the things that were identified in that community review a reality for our city. We've got economic development issues that need to be addressed. Preston needs to go out and attract the kinds of businesses that we want for our community that will bring with it good jobs and with that an increased tax base. We can't be passive about that. We have to be active and, and determine what that future needs to be and then go after it. Our infrastructure is something else that's aging and the city's doing a good job right now on maintaining what we have. Uh, but there's more that, there that can be done as well and I would make sure that we are out looking for the funding to do that. Thank you.